Hey guys, welcome back for another bath bomb demo. Okay, so we're finally gonna get to do this beautiful, sparkly, colorful mermaid egg from Rebel Sirens. Now, I went to go do this one last week, but then I realized I was having water issues and that was a real bummer, but we're gonna get to do it today and I'm super, super excited. I've never done uh, one of her bath bombs before, so this is gonna be a first for me. Um, let me go ahead and tell you about this scent. It is scented in Caribbean Escape and the scent notes in that are sweet melon, raspberry nectar, Italian lemon, creamy coconut, and raw sugar cane. It's super tropical, but I'm gonna go ahead and tell you this smells so good, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in my top three, hands down. I've never smelled a tropical scent like this before. It's so authentically coconut. It smells like you have just stuck your face in a bag of super sweet, real coconut. But it's not just that, it's, it's got more depth to it. I, I think that might be the sweet lemon, not sweet lemon, the sweet melon, but it's not watermelon. I'm not sure, I can't put my finger on it, but I'm almost glad I didn't get to do it that first day because I've, I was out of town this weekend, but since I've been back last night, I've just I've been sniffing it and sniffing it, so I can't wait to take this bath, but this is just one of the best scents I've ever smelled. It's, it's amazing. So this scent to me, if this wasn't so gorgeous, would be the highlight, but um, the scent um, matches how beautiful this bath bomb is. So I'm just, I'm really, really excited. And she's had this one out for a while and I can't believe um, since I have it in my hand and it's this pretty, it smells so good that I waited this long to purchase it. But anyway, let's go ahead and get it in the water. I don't know if it's gonna float um, or not. It's pretty heavy, so um, I'll hold it up for a little while and we'll see. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started. You'll have to excuse my hand. I don't know if it's going to float still, and I do not care. It makes absolutely no difference to me. There's, there's kind of nothing left on the bottom now. It's kind of flat on the bottom. I'm trying to get back far enough with my phone where I can get all the bath art, but I don't want to let it go. Oh, look, I think I see. Yeah, there's like yellow coming out of it now. Wow. Oh, it's so pretty. Very, very pretty. I'm really wiggly. Oh my goodness, there's like two different colors of green. Kind of a turquoise and like a bright kind of neon green and yellow and pink and purple. They're just all different kinds of colors coming out of this one. And it's like speckledy, the, the kind of speckled colors that I, I think are really pretty. I think it give it, um, it gives it a lot of dimension. Again, don't mind my arm. <laughs> okay, let's see. Oh my gosh, it's like, 
the pink and the yellow are kind of making like an orange color. So it's, it's got embeds like deep down in there all the way through. Cool. And yeah, the scent is just, it's just awesome. Very unique, very strong. And I'm gonna let it go now. Let's see if I can get back. Show you guys the extent of this bath art now. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to see. And I probably could have let it go before then, but didn't want to take any chances of messing up all the potential, those embeds. I love those colors and I love all the different little speckled colors. That is the very, very end of it. It's still going. And I can't quite tell what the color water is going to be the final color, but with all these cool colors, which are my favorite, I think it's going to be awesome. Okay, okay, it's all fizzed out. Now it looks like it's going to be some kind of blue, unless it gets a little more purple after we stir it up. So let's go ahead oh, and see. Oh my goodness. So oh, pretty. You don't see a lot of bath bombs um, turn a blue like this, and it's just like one of my favorites. Just absolutely one of my favorites. And I can't tell yet about the shimmer, but it, it looks like it might have that might have that trailing luster. Um, I'm not going to be able to tell 100% until I get in there, but that's what it looks like. And that is my favorite, too. Oh, my gosh. Yep, I think that's what it has in there, too. Okay, this has, and you know, unless something drastic changes when I get in there, this looks like it has me ordering several more all over it, you guys. Wow, it's just gorgeous. Okay, um, let's check out the bubbles, but I can't wait to get in here. Okay, so awesome. It's just awesome. Okay, y'all, that water to me is just stunning. It's absolutely stunning. If it were me, I probably, I don't know that I would turn on the jets. Um, I would just, that water to me is just absolutely perfect. So I'm kind of hoping I don't get bubbles. Um, I don't know, we'll see. Let's go ahead and see though. And I might not leave them on even if I do, but we'll check it out. Because then I will be able to see the gorgeous shimmer against the contrast of that beautiful, like deep ocean blue water. But we will see anyway to see if we can make a bubble bath out of it if we want to. And it definitely looks like we're gonna get some bubbles. So it's the best of both worlds. But I'm gonna go ahead and turn them off now so when I get out of the shower, um, they'll probably be um, calmed down some so I can have a bath with that awesome blue water. So I'll see you guys in a minute and I'll let you know how it was. Okay guys, so I'm done with my mermaid egg bath and this is what we have left. Down there in the bottom, it's just kind of piles of that luster. It's that gorgeous, gorgeous luster and that's gonna rinse right down. Now the ring around the outside, that I think is I think it's the cosmetic glitter. It's just blue. Um, I run my finger around it. It's not colorant, and that also just wipes right down. So 
I'm not displeased with that at all. I absolutely loved this bath. I will be reordering this bath bomb. I'll reorder a couple. I think um, I'm definitely gonna get one for myself. I'm probably gonna get one as a gift and then I'll probably put one in a giveaway. So I'll probably be ordering a few more of these. The scent was amazing. Um, the watercolor might have been my favorite part, that in the scent, but obviously it was beautiful. Um, definitely go check her out. I will have her links listed down below. Um, I have another one. I actually have two more of her bath bombs, so I look forward to demoing those again. But let me know what you guys thought down below. Um, I'm sure you thought it was as fabulous as I did, but um, I have... Um, a couple of pictures of this on Instagram too, so go ahead and check that out. But anyway, thanks for watching today, you guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.